Well, it's considered the Bible of Texas football. Talking about Dave Campbell's Texas football, the 2019 edition is out with a Texas quarterback Sam Ellinger on the cover. Joining me now, the editor-in-chief, Dave Campbell, who founded this magazine back in, what, 1960? 1960, that's right. We're, we are now 60 years old. <laughs> And you, you still serve as editor in chief. Uh, this year's publication, I mean, I look at it; it's a huge, thick magazine. Um, Four hundred pages. It's a, it's a, it's a big one. And I, I checked with Brooke Bednarz, our sports, um, our sports reporter, and she had a copy, of course, and it's well loved already. You can see the bindings already. Good. She's used it a lot already. So sports writers, anybody who loves football, they're going to find what they need to in this magazine. That's right. Well, when you started it, did you dream that it would last as long as it has and become the um, icon that it is for Texas football? To tell you the truth, Ann, that first year, uh, very foolishly, we went back to press uh, when we started getting telegrams saying we have to have more magazines. Uh, so very foolishly, I went back to press and printed 20,000 more. We uh, we lost in that first year five thousand dollars, and that was out of your pocket. Right? That's right. <laughs> so uh, I would have quit probably, but my wife said, "No, you had such good reviews on this, you have to keep going." Yeah, let's keep going. And so um, we uh, so we did keep going. The next year we were smarter than all that, but we just lost three thousand dollars. <laughs> So eight 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 thousand dollars really was out of my pocket, you might say. Yeah. So. But but you had faith in in what and obviously it was something that was needed, because it's not just college football; it's high school football, and there's nothing bigger in that's, Texas. That's exactly right. So in in uh, the third year, we started breaking even, and then we started making money and making. Like, kept going, going, going. Well, now it's something that folks anxiously anticipate the release each year of uh, Texas football. You've got, uh, you've got the UT quarterback, as uh, you see. And um, what's interesting about this, that uh, Texas has been on the magazine's cover ahead of each of the four seasons that they won a national championship. Well, I didn't realize that. But... Uh, I, I can guarantee you Longhorns are aware of that. <laughs> Sam Ellinger will certainly lead them to whatever glory they can achieve. <laughs> now, what's going to be interesting, last year, uh, Oklahoma had the uh, Heisman Trophy winner. Mm -hmm. And I don't know whether uh, this boy who transferred from Alabama to head Texas this year, uh, to head uh, Oklahoma, will win, on, win the whole the Heisman, but I guess he has a chance, and uh, it's going to be interesting to see just how far Sam Ellinger can lead the long Well, horse. we'll we'll see. We'll know later uh, later in the year for sure, and next year also. I just wanted to point out that I found this uh, uh, recently. It's a souvenir edition of the Texas football featuring uh, the 1974 Baylor Championship uh, team and Grant Taft. So folks, uh, folks get these and they hang on to them. They are they are a memento and a a famous famous thing to to hang on to. And we are so. Glad that you could be with us today well, to talk, talk a little football. Thank, thank you, you very, very much.